अन्या गोपी का माता जी सॉरी माई इंटरनेट वेंट ऑफ Were you able to do everything until here, right? Panch Tattva Mahamantra. I can't see the screen, Mata Ji. Mata Ji, we we can't see it now. This is still breaking. Just give me one quick second. Mata Ji, we okay. Can... Yeah, can you? Hello, Shama. All right, so kids, let's quickly do Hare Krishna Maha Mantra eleven times. All right, let's get started with that. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. कृष्ण हरे हरे Hare Rama, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Rama, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama. Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Rama Hare 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 Rama Hare Krishna Hare Rama 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 Hare Rama
Why not do it? All right. That was wonderful. Good job. Um, Anya Gopika Mataji, can you give me presenter rights again? Dear co-host, yes? You are yeah, no, I, I joined on another laptop, so. Oh, which, which number? Where you are talking? Yeah, you are already co-host, Mataji. Show my name, Lakshmi. Yeah, you are co-host. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Lakshmi. You see me now, right? Yeah. Okay, Mataji. Okay, thank you, Mother Yeah. Okay. Mother do you want to start sharing screen instead? Yeah, yes, Mataji, you want to me to share this? Yeah, screen? can you can you share the screen? Yeah, I changed my laptop. Just a second, I have to download the this one. And... All right, but meanwhile, let's start here. All right, kids, thank you. And sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't know why my laptop or my internet is so bad today. But let's get started. It's story time now. It's a short story, and most of you may have heard it before. Um, but let's read the story again. Um, it does have a good morale to it. So let's read it and see what we learn from this today. All right, the story is about a foolish friend. Should we trust a foolish friend? No, ma I know. Krishna. I know. Mataji, I cannot see the screen. Okay, okay. I know. Just a second, please. I'm making up. I know. Just a second, okay? I'm starting. It's downloading in my computer. That's fine, Mataji. Lakshmi Mataji, go ahead, yeah. Hmm. PowerPoint. Let's do one thing. I'm going to just make... I can see you, Mataji. That's enough. Mataji, I'm doing it. Just a second. Right, you can hear me, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Madhuri, go ahead. No problem. Just I'm one just minute. I'm going in and out. Okay. Um, are you showing, Madhuri? No? Yeah, yeah, I'm showing, Madhuri. It's coming now. Just uh, the, I downloaded it. Hmm. Okay, I see it. Down, 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 down. Who is friends? You do next. Okay. All right, thank you, Mataji, for sharing. All right. So you can hear me, kids, okay, right? All right, so today's story, everybody can hear me, right? Yes, Mataji. Yes, Mataji. Okay, cool. Yes, yes Mataji. Okay. All right, kids, so let's get started. So today's story yes, is all about a foolish friend. Thank you, kids. So it's about a foolish friend. So if you have a foolish friend, what kind of impact it can have on our lives, right? So the story is about that. So they were long ago, again, our, all our stories are long ago. So there was a king called Vikramaditya. And he was very, very fond of a monkey. Do you see? Look at the monkey with King Vikramaditya. He's like holding the monkey just like a baby. So he was very fond of this monkey. Uh, who is um, Vikramaditya's pet as well. So it's a pet monkey who he keeps, always keeps with him all the time. And he's very fond of, uh, of that monkey. So that pet monkey would always stay with the king and would never leave him. So wherever the king goes, the monkey goes. So they both are always, always together. All right, so let's go to the next slide. Okay, and then um, King Vikramaditya is also thinking that, okay, this, mon this monkey actually serves me better than anybody else. 
He is better than a human being. He is there. He would press my legs whenever I need, whenever I'm tired. And he would massage my body with oil. So he will do everything that I need to be done or a human can do. But he always does a better job. And you know, he's a monkey. He's an animal. So he can't even speak. So he can't even reply back, right? So King can say anything to him, but he wouldn't even say anything in return. So he's the perfect loyal um, pet or servant for him. And King is, yeah, King is actually thinking like that. He says that, oh, he serves me better than any of my servants or even my queen. He is the best. So the next slide um, is, so one day King Vikramaditya uh, went to his garden. So he had a very, very big and beautiful garden around his palace. So you see, and you know that all the, you know that um, all the castles or palaces where king and queens used to live, and they still live, right? Uh, that is a beautiful castle. And around the castle, they usually have a very beautiful garden as well, which is maintained by, you know, the gardeners or anybody. They don't have to do anything, but gardeners maintain that garden for them. So this king, Vikramaditya, also had a very, very beautiful garden. And he went there once with his um, wife, who's a queen, and also the monkey, because monkey follows him everywhere. So the monkey was also there with him, and they were just roaming around. And after all that, um, with all that roaming around, they had a nice walk around the place. They got back to their palace. So the next slide. All right, so they got back. They both were so tired that they went to bed. So they were, you know, they were in deep sleep after they slept off. The monkey was there in the room. So while the queen and the king are sleeping, monkey's job was to, again, as a loyal servant, he would do everything. So he would still stay there with them. He, he will make sure that um, nobody's disturbing the king and the queen and um, he would take care of them. So that is what the monkey used to do when the king would go to sleep. Okay, let's go to the next slide. And then after some time, what the monkey sees is that a fly comes and the fly would sit on King's forehead. But monkey's job was to make sure that the King is sleeping well and there's nobody who is disturbing the King. So he's, he, he's making sure um, that that happens. And when he sees the fly, he tries all his ways to you know move the fly from King's forehead. The fly would fly away right but you know how the flies are they'll keep coming back and they'll keep going and they'll keep coming back that's what they do all the time so this particular fly was also doing the same she will just keep coming back and sometimes would sit on the king's forehead or on on his nose or you know on his face so she will just keep doing that and monkey was trying hard to get rid of that fly finally when the fly would just keep coming back the monkey decided that okay enough in, enough is enough now the only thing that is left is that i should kill this fly so once i kill this fly she will never come back so that is what the monkey decided let's go to the next slide and see so after thinking that he should kill the fly he immediately got the sword which he had for king's protection he got it and then the fly was actually sitting on King's nose at that time. But Monkey, who was actually foolish, uh, he didn't think of anything else. The only thing he was thinking is that how should I get rid of the fly? And he immediately used his sword to kill the fly. And the fly was sitting on King's head. And when he did that, what happened? Flies are very smart, right? It's not easy to catch the fly. We have flies. We have seen it all the time, right? We keep getting flies in our homes and then it's not easy to catch them. So, well, the same thing happened with the monkey. The fly actually flew away. So he actually couldn't kill the fly, but instead he killed the king. So this is what will happen, right? He's using a sword to kill the fly who's sitting on king's face. That is what will happen. So he, he killed the king. Next slide, Mataji. All right, yeah, that's what happened. Next slide, Mataji. All right, so he killed the king and this is all. And this, this was a short story and this is where we end the story and let's talk about what we learned today. Did we learn anything from this story? Hare Krishna Mataji can Vrinda and Shama go. Yeah, sure, Vrinda. Vrinda and Shama go. Mataji, Vrinda.
Um, he he was just thinking that the that he would kill the fly, not the king, but he killed the king. Yeah, he was stupid enough. Uh, to he, that, right? And then um, what I wanted to say was that um, when he was thinking about the monkey and being always. Kids, kids, hold on. Uh, hold on. Just one sec. Give, uh, give some time to Vrinda and Shyama to finish up first. Then we'll come to you. Okay? And then I'm going to say. So what I was going to say was when the monkey was really like going with him and serving him. Um, one day when the king was like sleeping a lot with his wife, I saw. Um. Oh. There was a fly coming and he was trying to distract the fly, but then he used it, but then he said it's too much for him to do it. So he put out his knife. He pulled out his sword and tried to kill it, but instead he killed the king and it choked up. And then the king died. Exactly, right. So he was foolish enough not to understand <laughs> that. And happened. that's why this is. That's why the story's name is called The Foolish Friend. Right? <laughs> That's very true. What awesome. Good job, Rinda and Shyama. Can, Ga can Garima say? Yes. Garima, I have a few more hands raised, so I'll come to you. Hare so Krishna, can I go? Yeah, so let's start with uh, Rasika, Keshavi, Shubhadra, and Giridhari, Palvit, Rinda, and um, Hare Krishna, Mataji, Garima. can I go? Uh, Deepak, raise your up. hand. So give me one second. Let me just start from top. Uh, whoever raised the hands first. Okay, I'll go with them first. So Rasika, go ahead. I'll come to you, Deepak. Okay, man. Go ahead, Rasika. Uh, can I go? Go ahead. Can I go? Kisha, we go. Go ahead. Uh, I'm on mute or something. Yeah. So, um, um, the monkey was foolish, and at the same time, he didn't have common sense. So he would say, "Oh, um, I can just guard him. That's fine. He should have like, like, um, he can he can just leave it. Oh, like he's in deep sleep. You said he was in deep sleep. The king okay. won't notice. So." And that he can just take, like, try to distract the bug with food. I mean, um, the, like, the, the monkey do it and uh, at the same time worrying about the king. Um, yeah, absolutely. Watching yeah. the king. Can I go, Mataji? No, that's a good point. Okay, we'll go to Shubhadra and Girzari now. Okay. Hmm. Mataji, I was saying that okay. never kill others. <laughs> Because, because the monkey, the 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 foolish friend, like like uh, the monkey saw that the fly was in the king's nose that I just saw in the slide. Like I saw two slides. The one is like the 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 monkey is trying to kill <coughs> the fly, and the second slide I saw that um. He he the he, he he killed the king instead of killing the the fly. No right. Yep, that's a good point. Absolutely. And never kill others. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's the bottom line. Never kill others. That's correct. I mean, you should be sensible enough to even think. He couldn't even think that, right? He did not even realize that he's going to kill the king. So yeah, you have right. common sense. Common sense. Yeah, right. Yeah, Keisha, we have the same points. Wonderful. All right, let's go to Palvit now. A monkey was foolish. 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 He killed. He killed the. He killed the king. King. Yeah. Well, that's right. Good point, Paulit. Good job. All right, Brenda. So, mother, she, uh, like, I wanted to tell that he he should have have intelligence that um um uh, um we just have to work hard to remove the thing, and then we will not do anything. 
because kings are very in, in the good. So if we do something to the kings, it's very. Yeah, I know. We are. I think we're constantly saying the monkey was foolish. Monkey was foolish, but I think king was foolish too. He couldn't yeah. think through that. How can a monkey do the job of a human of protecting the king, right? Mataji, I was thinking like that, Mataji. Exactly. No, and the Keshavi, that was a really valid point. Yeah, I mean both ways. The both were stupid, I Mataji, guess. Mataji, like um, I just wanted to tell that last thing. Um, at the same time, he the king was foolish because. He, why would he say that? He's just a monkey. He's not yeah, just, better than a human being. He just does it, like other right. monkeys do. Some some mon some people have monkeys as their pet. They just um serve them. They just say get water. They'll get water. But it's not like they're the, they're the best human being. Krishna oh is God. like the mm. exactly. And everybody has a response, right? We know the Varna system, right? Everybody has a responsibility. You can ask a human to ask a question. Okay, Garima? Garima. No, yes, like uh, how this, like, like uh, how this monkey, when he's serving the king, is not like how, how can a monkey serve the king? No, because he's no, he is he is like stupid because he's not using his brains, and you're also used. He's supposed to use your common sense, and you're supposed to think what you're doing. No, that's right. Common sense and foolishness, think right? I think before, the same point. Yep. Think Good. before you do that. Oh yeah, absolutely. Think before you do. Good point. Yep. Tushita. Never make foolish friends. Do you want to say something? Yes. Never make foolish friends. Oh, yeah, that is true. Yeah. So you become what your company is, right? What? Oh, always be with devotee. That's a very good point. All right, Rasika. Thank you. Thank you, Tushita. Uh, Mataji, we have to, we don't have to take animals. We should not take animals? Where? At home? We should not keep them as pets, right? Yes. Yeah, I got your point. Yeah, we should never do that. Yeah, I do that this way too. I have a pet at home. I have a dog at home, but we should never do that. We have no right to do that, right? Mataji, do you really have a dog? I, I do have a dog. Yeah, I have a tiny yeah, dog. Yeah, you do have a dog. Can I go? <laughs> okay, I'll show you my dog one day, okay? I want to, I want to um, watch me Mataji's house and Daniel's okay? Like that. Like, Daniel. Oh my God. All right, kids, we'll have dog discussion some other day and I'll show you my dog, okay? So let's go to Madha for now. Madha, can you please tell me about the Mataji's dog? Okay. So let's go to Madha for now. Mother? Yeah, you yeah. see, so you should make friendship, friendship. with intelligent people. Intelligent people who can who can raise our raise our consciousness. Consciousness. Ah, what a good point. Yes. So never be friends with foolish. Be friends with intelligent people. I'm coming to you. I remember. I remember. Okay, let's do it quickly, kids. Isha and Vikram, Deepak, I'm coming to you. But there's only one. Isha and Vikram. Hare Krishna, Mataji, Deepak, can I go? I'm coming to you, Deepak. Just one more, kid. You should. Isha, Deepak. No. The animal can serve you like a demon because. Because the monkey killed the king, the monkey. Yeah, that's right. It's a very valid point, actually. Ashubhadra? Never kill others like the monkey kills the fly. He, he didn't look at it. He's foolish. He's only looking at the fly. He didn't recognize it. Yeah, right. Good point, Shubhadra. 
All right, now Deepak. Uh, the monkey first should decide if he needs to use a tool or not. He decides he needed to use a tool. That's right, but he used a big tool. You should, for, if you're trying to help someone and serve them for devotional service, you have to just... You have to chant Hare Krishna, then the bug will go, or you have to try to be, try to um, put something the bug likes on the window, um, maybe outside, then the bug can smell it, go outside, you can shut all the doors to protect the king, king or to serve you need to first decide what you will use you can't go like okay this is with man but the, the, wow. this is a he has, has given too many options for Madhuti, the I, I want to see a question i have one more question yes brenda i wanted to say that uh, we have to use a uh, um, tool which is um, um good and not like a spot Yeah, no, right. That's a good point. And we'll sum we'll sum up all this later. Good job. All right. So we'll end up with um we'll end with uh, Garima. Right? Garima, you haven't spoken yet, right? Mataji, she did Mataji. She did, right? Okay. All right. So we've done with all the kids. Wow. Tons of information, kids. And I really like your perspective. I know we're running out of time, but I like your perspective that you are trying to connect every single story with Krishna consciousness. And uh, yeah, that makes me so proud of you all. So very good. So I think the bottom line is, yeah, we realized that the king himself was foolish to give a sword to um, a monkey, right? Monkey is not supposed to be using sword because he cannot use your brains for all that. So foolish king, foolish monkey. And there are tons of other ways to protect yourself from flies or mosquitoes and things like that via sword. So, right. And um, besides that, okay, keeping all that aside, the best part about and best thing what we learned from the story is that... Um, how we can keep our company with the right kind of people, the Krishna conscious people, so that we are always in touch of devotees. Uh, we are what we, you know, live with. So our company matters a lot. If we are in a good company, we become a good human being. So all that matters. So good job, kids, with that. So much information today. All right, Mataji, can we go to the next slide and quickly run through the moral of the story, what the story says um, in this slide? Mataji, next slide. All right, kids. So it says wise enemy is better than a foolish friend, right? And you all said that. So good job there. Let's move on to the shloka time. Uh, Hare Krishna, Mataji, over to you. Anjana Gopika Mataji is going to take it, take it up for you, kids. Mataji, Jani, we didn't get the task. Can Jani be here? Yeah, I didn't hear her speaking. So, okay, oh, you go ahead, Janvi. Janvi, go ahead. Come. I was thinking Janvi doesn't want to speak. I was watching her. <laughs> go, ahead. go ahead, Janvi. What? What is your real And don't be foolish and don't have foolish friends. And never have pets. <laughs> Why? You don't like cats? <laughs> So would you like dogs? <laughs> you don't like any animal? Or no. animal? Oh, that's fine. Okay. Thank you so anyways, much. I, I believe in that. I don't think we should keep animals at home anyways, right? Cage them. So, yeah, good point, Janvi. Well done. All right, Mataji, you want to do shloka now? Yes, Mataji. Thank you so much, kids. I saw uh, today Brahma Samhita shloka. Uh, 5.33. You all can repeat after me. Sit down then. Okay. Advaitam achutam anadim. 
Recording in the group, I think. Mathiji, please take over for the Dev Nagari. Mathiji, ah, yeah. Thank you, Mathiji. Can, can, can you do yourself uh, sharing or should I do? Yeah, um, I will do it, Mathiji. Yeah. Okay. Yes, okay, Mathiji. Yeah, I'll try. I think my internet is still. Uh, you can there. try, Mathiji, otherwise I'll do, okay? Okay, Mathiji. Okay. प्रिपेर फॉर युअर पेपर एंड पेन्सिल माथी Teaching the Dev Nagari, okay? Yeah. All right, kids, are we ready? Mama. Yes, Mataji. Mama. All right, I'm going to just start sharing my screen. <laughs> शुभद्राशाली खा खी खाओ So, how about Vrinda, Isha, and Vikram do her now? So, start kids. Mata ji. Yeah. This is Shubhadra speaking. I'm saying that I saw Janavi said that she will do it. <laughs> Why can I not hear Janvi today? <laughs> All right, we'll come to Janvi also. So, Vrinda, Isha, Vikram, start with her. Ji. 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 Ji.
All right, good kids. All right, so um, Janvi, you want to do with Madhav and Tushita? Sure, let her. Awesome. Good job, kids. All right, and kids, you haven't gotten a chance today to read out the letters. Maybe next week. Okay, so we'll do the rotation. So kids who did today, we'll, you know, we'll skip those kids and the rest of the kids can do it. You can do it this way. With that, let's learn okay. our today's letters. Okay, so you all know that we are re re learning letter ch with different kind of markers. Chow, right? chow, cham, <laughs> all right, kids, hold on. I'm going to mute you all for a moment so that I can quickly talk about what I'm saying. All right. So we had been reading let and learning letters ch with different kind of matras from past two weeks. Today we finished letter ch and today's matras are ch. Your first one is ch with o matra is your cho. In English, we can write that as cho. Uh, one of the example of that could be chot. Chot is nothing but an injury in English. Mataji? Yeah. I know an example. All right, go ahead. I like that. Um, cho cho. Um, I don't know. I don't know how to spell that word. Cho cho. Yeah, cho cho. Something something. What is cho cho? No, the train goes cho cho. <laughs> okay, good try though. I I really do not know what that word is, but good try. <laughs> I like it. All right, <laughs> the next letter for today is. Well, the same letter cha with au matra. So cha plus au matra is chau. In English, you can write that as C H A U. Um, one of the examples could be chaukana. Uh, chaukana means being cautious or being alert, right? And like one of the examples I took today, which is more relevant for today, is that we should wear masks because of COVID. All right. So that is chaukana. Another word I just remember while talking is. For, for first one is um, Keshavi, Chor. Chor is a thief or a robber. Yeah. So that's another word. All right. Third one for today is Cha with Ang Matra. It's called Chang. And in English, you can write that as C H A M. Um, one, of the, uh, one of the letter, one of the word we can write with that is Chanchal. Uh, the example here is of the, of the ocean waves. And we usually say that the ocean is very chanchal, right? The water is very chanchal because it's not steady. So things that are not steady and, um, you know, very fickle Mataji, or very mobile. Yeah. Like, uh, this, this is Shubhada speaking. I'm saying, like, chanchal, like, like means, like, uh, you're going very fast and you're, like, going around everywhere, not stopping. Exactly. Somebody who's really fickle, right, cannot be steady. I can say Shubhadra is chanchal. That would mean Shubhadra is very naughty. Is that right? Wrong, Mataji. No. I'm just kidding. So anybody, see, I mean, you can use the chanchal word for anybody. It's not just related to water. You can use it for any humans also, right? If any kid is naughty or anybody is naughty or who's not very steady, who wants something, uh, you know, they, they just can't sit at one place for a long time. So we can say they're chanchal. So that's how you can use this word uh, for Last letter for today is ch with aha matra is chaha and in English you can write that as c h a h. Well, unfortunately, I do not, I cannot recall any word with this, and I couldn't find either. But if you know, let me know. All right, so these are the four letters for today. Um, very simple, very straightforward letters, but I would still write them on uh, canvas real quick. And let's finish up with this. And you can start writing as well. And let me know if you want me to back and forth anywhere. So first one is Cho. Everything starts with a vertical and horizontal line. line and you write your letter Cha here. The first is Cha plus O matra, right? So it is Cho. Again, reminding everybody, the matra has to be on the last vertical line only. Yeah. Yes. Okay, right. Oh, I didn't hear Mataji, you're not in the board. Mataji. Oh, I am so sorry. 
Oh, I'm in, so sorry. In Bengali, in, yeah, I'm sharing. I'm in, sharing my screen. Hold on. In Chow means like in Spanish. In some country, Chow means hello. Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's right. Good catch. All right. So kids, I've written first one, Cho, Ch, and O matra. Second one is one is second one is Ch plus O matra. That means two matras on the top of last vertical line. And I know some kids would write it like this, which is actually the right way to do it. The circular motion on the top. All right. So Ch, Cho, Cho, and the third one is Ch. So we write Ch, your regular Ch letter, and then um. Chung, sorry, Chung. So one, uh, one um, point on the top of Cha. And the last one for today is Chaha. Chaha. So again, a vertical and horizontal line, and you make your shape of a Cha. Cha. Sorry, it's uh, ugly. But yeah, two dots next to Cha is your Chaha. So four letters for today Cho, Cho, Chung, and Chaha. Uh, let me know if you want me to go back to the slides. Mataji, can you go back to the slides because the I didn't write what's the meaning of the first word. Yeah. Um, first yeah. word, what's the meaning? Is it like um injury or what? Chod is injury, yes, in English. Can you go to the white boy, Mataji? What's okay. the second one? What's the meaning? Second of one is Chow. Um, uh Chow Chokanna. I think yeah, that's what I've written. Chokanna. What does that mean? Like no? Chokanna means being cautious. Cautious or alert. Okay. Mataji, I have one word for for cha. Sorry, yeah. What's that? Mataji, it's Deepak. Chandra. Okay. Chandra. Oh wow! Right, that's a beautiful word. Chandra. Very well. This is Shubhadra speaking. Yes, Shubhadra. Mataji, what's the third word? Third one is chanchal. Um. So something that is not steady. Like not steady, like it's not, not steady, like, very mobile. Um, you know, Mataji, like it's not straight, but it's already big. Can you go to the board? Chancha okay. is um kind of an I would say adjective, I guess. It's an adjective, uh, which you can attach Hare to Krishna anybody. Hare Krishna Mataji. It's All right, Deepa, can I show my ma matras? All right, kids, kids, uh, listen to me. To hear me board? out. Kids, Mataji, hear me out. We are. We are over time now, so no, I. Mother, can you bring the Shama Sure. Uh, kids, we are already running out of time. The other class is already starting, so I'm so sorry. You may have to send everything to the WhatsApp today, and I'm definitely going to look at it. Mother, what's the meaning of the first word? That's all. A uh, meaning of what? Uh, um, the fourth fourth word that is chaha. Chaha. Well, there is no word for that yet, right? So I I couldn't find any word with that. Okay. So there's no word, right? Yeah, so you can leave that for now. All right, kids. Sorry, but we will have to finish the class right here. Let's finish the class with the Vaishnava Pranam Mantra. It's <laughs>